and just do this part now. All right, folks, Fumbles is going to defeat the final boss. Oh, well, okay, shit, hit O. And then O again. All right, your objective, pick a box, it'll be a revolver, and shoot him. Uh, R1 in square is the fire, is aim, R1's aim, and fire is square. While you're doing that, I'm going to finish out this drink. R1 in square? R1 in square. Yeah, it's not the best of combos, but it's a stealth game. No, oh, you don't even have the R1. And I'm empty. Hey! Oh. <laughs> ah! Fifth empty uh, barrel to charm. Six shots. You have six shots. <laughs> mwah, 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 mwah. It's, it's actually fine because you would create a time paradox if you actually kill him. But you didn't see that, did you? Yeah. Oh, it was funny. First mission you do, oh, you beat up the, the shit out of uh, Ocelot and his crew. So we meet again. And if you take the time to Shot. kill him, it creates a time paradox. And it, 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 like it ends the game, says time paradox. Because Ocelot is dead. Uh, due to the fact that he's in the future. Oh, it's <laughs> you know, you there's always there's a lot of cool game mechanics. You were praising the uh saving for a week actually affects the game. Give me a hand. Uh there was one scene. It didn't work for me for some reason, but uh if you you got after the torture scene, there's always a torture scene in these games. After the torture scene if you save in the cell, you will go through a cutscene of, like, basically Devil May Cry shit. Ironically, now it would be, uh, I think, uh, uh Metal Gear Revengeance. And you play as a vampire, and <laughs> S Snake here is afraid of vampires. <laughs> yeah, most random thing to be afraid of. <laughs> Mm hmm. You missed the whole fight with the boss. Oh my god, I just joked it. <laughs> yeah, she's. She's. She's getting eaten by a horse! <laughs> oh, I am the boss now! Yeah, these these guys were coming to blow up the place. Oh no, Mix. Granted, I don't know why we had to do this entire operation if it was so easy to blow the place up. There's no way out. What are we gonna do? We've come too far to let them stop us now. Well, duh. Those things got to be armed. It's no use. There's no way we can outmaneuver them. They're gonna shoot us down. We were so close. Weapon systems on. Locked on target. I got towed. You were great, Eva. Huh? Thanks. We, we, we didn't really do much of anything. <laughs> Oak 19, this is Control. Stand by for a direct order from the chairman. Oak 19, return to base immediately. Do you read me? This is a direct order from Comrade Khrushchev. Return Jeez. to base immediately. Jeez, report the guy, man. Oak 19, do you copy? Understood. Aborting mission. RTV. I don't hear that often in movies. RTV. Look! The Migs, they're turning back! Woo! Kiss her. 
Kiss. 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 Yeah. Ah! Cock blocking! Cock blocking everywhere! Thanks. Well done, Snake. The Mig's disengaged. Most likely well, under orders Evil from was his way of helping you. Is this his way of helping us? Who knows? Maybe he didn't want things to get messier than they already are. Or maybe he just wanted us to owe him one. The important thing is, you made it out alive. As long as Khrushchev is with us, I don't think they'll be coming after you. It should be smooth sailing all the way to Alaska. I'm sending someone out to Galena Base to meet you. To meet me? The DCI and the President himself are waiting at We're going to meet the President! Don't keep them waiting. Uh... So... That's pretty much it, everyone. Metal Gear Solid 3. An entire bottle's worth of the Metal Gear Solid game. Drinking game. Don't play it in one go. I... I don't don't play it in one go, man. You will die. Or have a really wicked headache. Uh I won't go that far. I don't need a replay. I do uh no, no, never mind. I won't tell. You'll be my secret, and you'll be wondering. Yeah, it's time to get some. How did we get here? So what are you going to do now? Go back to the KGB? What do you want me to do? Do you ever think about coming back to America? I can't go back. I've left America behind me. Well, she saved the world. But you saved this country. I mean, we both did. You didn't do it alone. Wait, whoa, whoa, <laughs> whoa, whoa! Graphical error. And I still he has the there. headband in the back of his head, without it actually being on. Unless that was hair. I couldn't. I, 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 I looked like there was a headband there. Or is it an order? Oh. Is it an invitation? Hmm. Or a proposal? I don't take orders from anyone now. Oh, that carpet's that that carpet's ruined. <sighs> Finally. You're still you're still fully clothed though. You are You still have gloves on. You still you you got everything. Seriously. We can't be having these moments with At least take the shirt off. Shut that thing up. Why'd you even keep it on? Oh, damn. I'm surprised it's not going. Close. Close. You close. Nah, I, they did nothing. They spooned. That's about it. Look at pants. He has pants on? Seriously? Underwear, maybe. But pants? Scholars tell us that the first spine um, was the snake in the book of Genesis. 
In that story, it was Eve who was tempted by the snake. In the no, garden. no, the snake was the devil. It wasn't really a spy. It was possessed. Forbidden fruit of knowledge. Forgive me, snake. Um. Oh, okay. Okay, that was the camera. The button cam. Why don't you have time to write this? Or Hello, make it? Snake. I hope you slept well. First of all, I have to apologize. I wasn't sent by Khrushchev. Dun dun dun! I'm not a KGB spy, and I never worked for the NSA. I'm an agent of the People's Republic of China for the General HQ 2nd Department of the People's Liberation Army. It was all a lie. I tricked you. And I'm sorry. I bet your name's not really Eva. The philosophers still exist in China, too. You see... My mission was to find out where Volgan was hiding the Philosopher's legacy and steal it. So I infiltrated his base as a KGB spy. The two NSA codebreakers who defected in 1960... Yeah, had, had I been actually told that... The I know, I know, because you didn't have the code years. word. Saving me the trouble of having to eliminate him. I sneaked in by pretending I was Eva. And you and Sokolov and Volgan, you all believed me. The yeah, I know. We were told this several thousand times. And I've, I've already drank all the alcohol I could. The Russians and the Americans take it off I have no more. I mean, I don't want to borrow Zex. I got the film containing the legacy. And also the nuclear Wait. missile launch data from the Shagohad. Five years ago, the Soviet Union stopped supplying us with nuclear weapons technology. Since then, China's Liandan easing hydrogen bomb and space rocket projects have fallen behind. But with this data, our country will be able to develop its own nukes. We'll create a deterrent force to rival those of the U.S. and Soviet Union. You bitch. Everything has gone according to plan, thanks to your help. Wait. I too am one of the philosophers. I'm an agent of the philosophers, a graduate of one of their charm schools. I was raised in a joint U.S. Soviet Chinese facility to become a sleeper agent. This was before. Wait, the war. which war? Back the... then, they were collecting children from all over the world. As a result, I'm indistinguishable from a native-born American. So it didn't surprise me when you and Volgan couldn't tell the difference. But yeah. She knew right from the beginning. She knew because before the war, she was at one of the philosopher's schools, too, as an instructor. The boss was the only... Well, on the plus side, you got the bang an Asian chick, so, she you know... the only one who knew I was a fake. Props to that. She told me everything. Why did she open her heart to me like that? At the time, I, I couldn't understand it. But now... I think I do. Snake. She wanted you to know the truth. She chose me to tell you. That's why she saved my life. I've lied to you so many times, but not this time. My orders from the government were to obtain the legacy. And to eliminate everyone who knew the truth about what happened. In other words, I'm supposed to kill you. But you couldn't. Because you love me. But I oh. can't do it. 
Not because we love oh. each other. And not because you saved my life. Oh, well. But because I made a promise. Fine. I mean, that's that's and probably about as good as loving me or feeling of obligation of saving the world. And you have to live. Oh, whoa. Okay. I mean, most of that reel might be valuable still. I mean, it's not like it burned at all. Snake, listen to me. What? She didn't betray the United States. No. Far from it. She was a hero who died for her country. She carried out her mission knowing full well what was going to happen. Self-sacrifice. Because that was her duty. Uh, is that, is that, what, everyone but sick? Oh no, they're sick. Wow, black guy in the office. No one would have suspected that happening. this guy? Is this a president? You are above even the boss. I hereby I'm the big the boss. A big boss. Who? This is not the president. You this is no one that existed in history. Shake his hand. Yeah. Are you? I want to shake your hand. I'm not the president. Get the hell out of my way. Who didn't shake my hand? You know, we could use an infiltration unit like Fox in the army. Someone like him to handle our top secret sneaking missions for us. A man who combines the qualities of a soldier and an agent. The boss's defection was a ruse set up by the U.S. government. It was all a big drama staged by Washington so they could get their hands on the philosopher's legacy. And the boss was the star of the show. We're gonna go see a movie, paramedic? They it so that they could get the legacy that Colonel Volker Okay, we'd stop clapping now. He's left the, the room. At the same time. Only a legendary hero like the boss could have earned Volgan's trust. Finding out where the philosopher's legacy was hidden was to be her greatest mission. Wait, was Everything this still part of the reel? To plan. But then something happened that no one could have predicted. Colonel Volgan fired an American-made nuclear warhead at Sokolov's research facility. Khrushchev demanded that the U.S. government provide proof that it wasn't involved. They couldn't just abort the operation to steal the legacy. So the operation itself was greatly expanded and revised. The authorities in Washington knew that in order to prove its innocence, they'd have to get rid of the boss. And that one of their own would have to do the job. The public couldn't be allowed to find out about it. Not ever. This, they concluded, would be the best way to... Is that why she knew I was going to lie? The boss wouldn't be allowed to come back home alive. And she wouldn't be allowed to kill herself. Her life would be you know. by the most beloved disciple. That was the way the government wanted it. That was the mission she was given. Damn, that she sucks. She had no choice but to carry it out. Her death in your hands was a duty she had to fulfill. Out of duty, she turned her back on her own comrades. Yeah. 
down. A lesser woman would have been crushed by such a burden. The taint of disgrace will follow her to her grave. Future generations will revile her. In America, as a despicable traitor with no sense of honor. And in Russia, well, she'll be fine in China. China's like, yeah, we don't care. She will go down in official history as a war criminal. And no one will ever understand her. That okay. was her final mission. And like a true soldier, she saw it through to the end. But I think she wanted you, of all people, to know the truth. She wanted to live on in your memory. Not as a soldier, but as a woman. But. Okay, I can. She was forbidden what? to tell you herself. That's why she told me. We will. We'll never know what you we, will. we will. We will. We will. Her story. We will. Briefing. Rock you. Okay, that this can't all be on the little reel. Everything she said. During sex. She did for her country. She sacrificed her life and her honor for her native land. Captain America. That's that's the thing that made Solid Snake and Liquid Snake and Solidus Snake. Been the cell guard. Oh, motion actors. Motion actors are always cool. You'd better take it all. They'll tell you what they know. But they won't. Skip. No? No skip. Okay. Well, that's it, everyone. Thanks for joining me. I'll be getting Peace Walker. I won't be doing four just yet. Peace Walkers come next. And this is going to be different because I've never peed. Play, never peed. I never peed Peace Walker. I might be a little drunk right now. Anyway, thanks for joining me. See you all next time. Yes, Grozny Grad and the Granin Research Facility have both been wiped out without a trace. 
I understand, sir, but they were necessary sacrifices. Yes, the CIA has taken care of the boss themselves. I believe the White House will be satisfied. Khrushchev is finished. Your time has finally arrived. Yes, the American president is relying on us to keep a lid on the whole affair. We've got him by the balls. It should make a valuable trump card in future negotiations. Yes, Chief Director, of course. I'll keep the KGB informed. Yes, it's me. The boss has accomplished her mission. The philosopher's legacy is now safely with us, in America's hands. With this money, yes, the philosophers can finally be revived. The film we handed the Chinese was a fake. <laughs> Peking must be in an uproar right about now. I'm afraid so. Only half the money has made it back to the United States. The KGB must still have part of the legacy. Yes, the weapon has been reduced to ashes. That's right. Grozny Grad has been obliterated by the Davy Crockett we brought in as well. Yes, that was the boss's work too. Speaking of which, I've obtained something from Granin that you might find interesting. It's a revolutionary new nuclear attack system. Perhaps it might just come in handy someday. Yes, we have John, I mean Snake, to thank for that. Khrushchev believed it as well. Yes, they bought our story. I don't think they'll be making a fuss. The secondary alert has been lifted as well. And the Soviets still haven't discovered my true identity. They have no idea that I've been triple crossing them. I will continue my activities as a contact for the new government. Yes, it appears that no one knew that I was Adam. Of course, I am always at the CIA's disposal, Mr. Director. <laughs>